In this video, we're going to talk about actors inside of Unreal Editor. So the first question is, what are actors? Well, actors can be anything inside of Unreal Ed. Characters, trees, rocks, walls, staircases, weapons, grenades, all kinds of stuff. Your sky, if there's a bird flying around in the sky, that's an actor. Characters running around, the player. Uh, that's running around, jumping around on enemies and stuff. That's an actor. The enemies are actors. Pretty much everything is an actor, including lights, triggers, player start, uh, start points, all that stuff. All of that is actors. So we're going to look at how to select actors and how to place actors inside of your level in Unreal Editor. So selecting actors is pretty, pretty uh, simple. All you have to do is go up to the scene outliner on the top right and you'll see uh, a list of all the actors that are currently existing inside of your level. Just click on them and you'll see the actors selected. If you hit the escape key you'll deselect any actors that are selected. You can also select an actor by just directly going in the viewport and left clicking on the actor itself with the mouse. Pretty easy. We also have to look at how to place actors. This is actually uh, one of the most important things that you're going to be doing in Unreal Ed when you're working. And it's something that you're going to do about 85 to 90 percent of the time while working in Unreal Editor. So if I look over here at the Content Browser, I'm going to take the Content Browser tab, pull it away with the left mouse button to tear it off into its own window. And I'm just going to expand this window a little bit. And the Content Browser is where all of the assets in your project are located. So animations, blueprints, characters, special effects, and particles meshes, things like that. I'll click on the environment folder here and I'll use my static mesh filter so that I only see static meshes. And static meshes are created in other programs such as Maya or 3ds Max and then imported into Unreal Ed. I'm going to go to the text field and I'm going to do a quick search for can or trash can and you're going to see a trash can item here that comes with the shooter game example and I can select that trash can, highlight it in yellow just by clicking on it and if I right click inside of my viewport you'll notice that if I go to the place actors menu whatever's selected in the content browser is going to update and pop up here then I get another menu and it's going to show me at the top the selection whatever's in the content browser and is selected will pop up recently placed actors we can also place some commonly placed actors such as lights and also cameras, player starts, blocking volumes, triggers, things that are uh, usual things that we place quite often inside of Unreal Ed when we're working on a level. So I'll click on this trash can and it'll place it right inside of my uh, viewport here in the level. One of the most common ways that I like to use to place items is simply by dragging and dropping them from the content browser into my viewport. This is probably the easiest and most straightforward way of placing actors in, the, in, the, in my level and it's probably the most common method that I personally use when working in Unreal Editor. So that's pretty much it and that's all there is to it when placing actors inside of Unreal Editor.